you go into dreamland with them. That's a pretty high level of trust. And dreamland is one hell of a good place to take a prospect if you want to turn them into a client and a friend. I really like that angle of bringing the conversation of net worth into it. Reframing conversations is such a critical skill when you're trying to influence people. Whether it's influencing your clients, your referral partners, your kids, your spouse, or even trying to get out of a traffic ticket. It's all about influence. And you want to influence your clients to think about the increase in net worth, not the increase in their monthly payment. No matter how many times you post that stupid, when you rent, you pay 100% interest meme on Facebook, people aren't going to get it until you explain it to them. You have to earn their trust, then explain it to them. There are tons of tools you can use. Mortgage Coach teaches on their TCA or total cost analysis. MBS Highway has their buy versus rent tool. Okay, let's bring it all together. First, people don't know jack about home buying, but they wanna buy. Second, the key is that you have to make more offers. You have to, you just have to. You have to, have to, have to, have to, have to, have to, have to. But yeah, you're going to get some nose with that. You just have to live with it. You have to earn the right to give a recommendation. You have to earn the right before you sell. You do that by using empathy and curiosity to have them state three reasons they want to buy now. But you are going to have sticker shock over the price change. So you have to be ready to explain to them how debt ratios work, that if they do buy at this because of debt ratios, they can probably still afford to live, and then bring them to dreamland by anchoring their mind on the increase in net worth. You can do it. 